everyone, welcome back to Waytail Land Farm Goat Milk Soap. Today we're going to make a, another one of our Christmas soap cupcakes. We're going to make um, White Christmas. Um, I'm going to try to answer a lot of your questions from the previous video of the gingerbread cupcakes um, as we go. So I have my goat milk in lye all ready to go. We're going to add that to our oils. <clears throat> give that a quick stir So in my last video I got asked a couple of times about how do I determine how much I set aside for the bottom and how much I set aside from the top. Well, I can't give you a straight answer for that because it's a lot of trial and error. It depends on um, how much you put in the bottom or how much you pipe on the top. But um, you kind of just got to give it a couple of times and just figure that all, all out for yourself. So we're going to separate the bottom. some of our fragrance to that. We'll add some brown colorant for the bottom. Use a different, couple different colorants to get the right shade that I want. It helps to get nice bottoms if your soap batter is extremely fluid. Just makes a nicer, cleaner bottom. Starting to thicken up a bit. One or two more. Now we'll come back. 
back over here and we'll separate our toppings. Actually, let me clean it first. Okay, so now that we're finished with the bottoms, we'll start on the top. So we're going to do red, white, and green. Start with our white. And we'll go with our green. Or our red. And then our green, I like to use a mixture make sure we get the right green that we're looking for So we're going to let those set up and we'll get them into piping bags and we'll start to pipe. Hey everyone, welcome back. We're ready to pipe. Um, I, last time I got asked about the tip that I use and I like to use the, the Wilton 1M. Looks like my... Green in my...
Hey everyone, we're ready to unmold our Christmas soap cupcakes. We'll unmold a couple so you can see them. Do one from over here. There you go. I hope you all have a great day.